Ooh. That's really good. I want that planet. I need to find a large arctic. Or uh, be able to... Ooh. This is a good one. I need to get to this place ASAP. But it's going to take me a while to get arctic. Resource discovered... We found hydromalai and stuff. We, we, we. Exploration of Osulo. Plus 20 science. Hooray. What's this one? Plus 5 science. Hooray. Research complete. Okay, xenology. Hooray. And then we get those strategic resources, which means we can do more stuff. Or at least it increases, like, approval and shit like that. Uh, arid is not a bad place to start. Tundra. Where's Arctic? Arctic. That's a good one. Let me close that before I figure out what I want to do. Yeah, I really want to do Arctic. Because though, though that's a that seems like a good system there, and it, it's kind of cut off though. It doesn't really give me a. A choke point that I'm looking for, but those planets are really hard to ignore. Uh, how bad is Arctic? Though? I forget. Uh, lots of disapproval, but lots of uh, other good stuff. That's not... Uh... No, okay. It's, uh, okay. I got it now. Okay, let's see. What was this place we found? Desert and Arctic. Hostile fauna. I don't want to go there at all. <laughs> Seismic, yeah, this system is like, I don't want to go to this system anytime soon. Colonizer, go to Osulo. Science. Self-right seems to be really good for you. Right now, I've discovered uh, two different star systems. They're uh, all uncolonizable, uh, so I can't fucking invade there or do anything with it yet. And I got two super... Uh, uh, re Red super giants here, so yeah. So far, not that great. <laughs> I'm looking forward to where you're living, huh? Yeah, it's pretty much like the Bronx and New York. <laughs> um, wait, didn't I? Oh, I, I selected it. It's fine. Uh, do I want to build anything after? No, I don't think so. Well, maybe I do. Xenotourism. Uh, that's a lot of money. I should do that. Now, wait. How much would be another investigator? Seven turns, huh? Uh, yeah, I really should get another scout out there. <laughs> After they're done with that. Okay, I'm done. This would be kind of neat to actually see this from your perspective once this is uploaded. Oh, and yeah. you'd be I have no idea where you are, and that's kind of interesting that way. I'm so used to playing as the amoeba, or using at least amoeba infinity, so I can see the entire fucking galaxy from the get-go. Hmm. So this is an interesting thing for me. Alright, let's see. Oh, nice. We got a planet I can colonize. Uh, we're definitely doing that. Uh... Tree. Where's the f wormholes? Uh, there's wormholes. Let's see. Fundra. After I get Arctic, I need to do wormholes and then figure out what I'm going to do with the rest of this shit. And what's this one do? Expansion. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that's a good one anyway for colonization. Yeah. So my people will be unhappy the first place to go, but, you know, that's that's life. That's life out in these harsh cosmos. Well, at least with your little empire. Right now, I'm just trying to keep my guys happy while still being able to power myself up here. I need All to get right. some attack ships going or something. Uh, do I have enough money for a hero yet? Uh, where's the fuck? Oh, I have to go to the academy. That's right. Oh. What do I got here? Three different heroes for hire. Administrator and corporate, that's good. Administrator and corporate, that's good. Corporate and commander. Uh, 
Uh, let's inspect this guy. Generally, Hafer is made of stone and is respected for his wealth. Over 20 card pages, there's a personality change. Rumors based on her or hearsay refer to dust induced hallucinations pertaining to historical occurrences, present day operations, and probability distributions of future events. Regardless of the reason, Senator Bree left his job as head of accounting at the Polaris Workshop and now travels the galaxy. Still famed for his management, but also for his generosity. Um. It sounds kind of goofy, but you know what? Uh, so I think I need a goofy leader. <laughs> We're gonna take this alien guy. Uh, invasion military power and fleet. Uh, now nah, this guy just gives me more shit for the home plan. This is what I, I want anyway. <laughs> Sign you to um, home. Yeah. Uh. Oh, that's right. That's my home system. Right. Okay. Hey. Now I have a fucking governor. Um, I don't think I need to do anything else, so... Well, as long as he's not Emperor Palpatine. He kind of looks like him. <laughs> he looks... Cool. Even though it says he's nice now because, like, he went crazy from, like, snorting dust. Dust, by the way, folks, is the currency in this game. It's, it's your gold, so to speak. Execute all planned moves. There we go. Just got done researching something. I wonder what's over here. My influence zone. It's so big. Um, got already enveloping one system. Uh, by the way, for those wondering, influence zones. What they do is um, basically make it so that if an empire is not at war with you or they're not allied with you. They cannot cross into here unless they want to start some major shit. So, if your influence zone... Say, if my influence zone goes all the way over to FAD over here, uh, other douchebags can't come here unless they want to declare war. Now, you can't attack... Um, if you're outside of any uh, territory whatsoever, say if there was an influence zone here on this planet I'm clicking on, and it expands out to here. Um, actually, no, that's a bad idea, because you can't fight in transit, I don't think. No, you can't. Um, say there was a planet here, and its influence reached out to here, and my influence is just here. If two ship, if their ships and my ships met here, we could fight, kill each other, and there would be no war started because it counts as uh, it counts as a cold war. It's a neutral territory, so they can do whatever the fuck they want. So it's it's a uh, it's dog eat dog out, outside of uh, influence zones. You can't uh, can't use diplomatic immunity <laughs> and shit like that. We can't lethal weapon do this shit. Um, I don't think I need to do anything this round, really. Uh, no need to use a ship designer. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, let's see how, pe how happy my people are. Uh, they're, they're they're fairly happy. Uh, where's my uh, tax rate? Okay, we're bringing in a decent amount of money, so that means. Let's lower this a little. There we go. Oh, oh. Ecstatic. Let's keep it at... Let's keep it so that they're ecstatic. That actually boosts a lot of things. Yeah. Let's keep it at ecstatic. We're keeping the tax rate low. But that also... We have the science bonus for keeping our tax rates low anyway. So we want to really, really do that. And the happier everybody is, uh, the more I can expand, yada, yada, yada. Uh, done here. Next round, I'll have my um, Evolved Soils. I am done. Damn, that sucks. All um, zones, uh, I pretty much explored everything I can explore right now. So all I can do is uh, <laughs> jump systems, I guess. Oh, so... Uh, uh, just a refresher, you know what those wavy lines are between systems, right? Like, not the straight lines that are solid, but, like, the ones that are, like, wispy and stuff. They look like smoke. Yeah. Uh, well, I don't really know what they are, but... They're wormholes. You can't travel through them until you research the technology, which is, like, the third level down on the on the bottom tier. So you can keep jumping between systems until you reach one of those wispy lines. And then, if you have the technology, you can just go right through the fuck through it. All right. I can show you where it is, or tell you where. Um, okay, you see on the bottom tree? 
All right. Yep. You see Zeo Botany. Uh, let's see. You know Botany. Yeah, the... I got that. Okay. Compact fusion reactors. Oh, the one uh, in the middle. Yeah, I see that. And look to the bottom left of that. Applied Casimir effect. Oh, all right. That, that's the one that gives you um, uh, space travel through wormholes so that you can go through the wispy lines. And it also makes it so people hate you less if you expand. All right, that's definitely the one I have to get because as things are right now, I'm just trapped. There's no other way I can go. <laughs> so, well, yeah, my universe is pretty... Uh, mm. <laughs> You're part of the galaxy. Stuck. Uh, stuck in space. I've got a few fair few places I can go. But, yeah. On the bright side, I'm... Uh, safe for a while. I mean, it's not like pirates can just jump right on my ass unless they have it. Pirates, right? Did, did you activate pirates? Uh, they should be activated. Okay, good. I've never actually faced pirates because I think I played an old version that didn't or like they were deactivated for some reason in mine. I don't remember. Hmm. Because it tried to... Actually, I don't remember what happened. Research complete. Uh, now it's going to go towards the um, compact fusion react. Wait, I think. Is that what I want? Yeah, that's what I want. Okay, cool. I'm juring so much science. My science boner is so big, you can't, can't even begin to fathom it. Wait, I already saw that. Okay. Ooh, what's Nihal? Uh, well, irradiate. <laughs> I don't like any of these plants around me. I'm not a fan of my planet, or basically my universe at the moment. Our difference, fa or flora? Gee, I don't like these at all. Irradiated, fuck off. I've learned my lesson with that shit. I gotta be more picky about where I go. Oh, there's another blue star over there. Oh, I, oh wait, I can't go that way because of the fucking wormhole, right? Uh, what's this? Uh, ooh, uh, exploration event, Nihal. Uh, let's see. A familiar area with space and structure. Uh, I saw that. Uh, I actually get an option this time. Uh, I can get plus 75 dust every five turns. Uh, that's pretty cool, actually, early on. Uh, plus 20% dust on Empire for 40 turns. Minus 33% by, uh, ooh. Mmm. I'm not sure which is more economically feasible from, or for, yeah, I guess for me right now. Uh, I'm gonna go with the plus twenty percent on the empire because once I get this uh, system over here, it's gonna start generating lots of cash. So I should be able to get some benefit from that by then. Let's do that. Plus, I'm still gonna get a bonus anyway. Yeah. Um. Am I done? Let me take a quick look. Oh, mm. Take your time. Right now I'm just hitching a ride. <laughs> hey, approval going down. More science! Oh, let's turn down the tax rate a little bit more. I'm keeping everybody as fucking pleased as fucking possible. You know, I forget when we started. Ah, uh, good question. Shit. Ah, <laughs> uh, um, fuck. Maybe fifteen minutes ago. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think I can figure out when we started. Um. All right. No, cancel. Uh, save game maybe. Uh, I would save seven twenty. So yeah. I would say 15 minutes ago. Only been that long? That can't be right. Oh, uh, well, I'll, I'll make a stop time for us. It'll probably be short, but whatever. So, <laughs> say 27 more minutes. May, well, yeah, 27 more minutes, something like that. We'll figure it out. Okay, so yay, plus 20% for a while. Let's see, 27 more turns. Ay, 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 ay. I hope there's a way out through here. Actually, I don't.